do I want to get? Let's get rid of that. You know, I'm using silk text to not have inventory space problems. So what I'm going to do is after I get this stuff, I'm going to go back and put all this stuff in chests. Um, so I don't have to worry about inventory space and come back out. That's what happens sometimes when you find caves when you're doing this stuff. Because all of this product is too good to give up on. It's needed. Hi. Sorry about that, buddy. I would have left you alone if you didn't come after me, bro. But he did. Why did I put a torch on something I'm going to do that with? I'm ha very happy at how well these picks are holding up. It's been a little while since I've had awesome picks in a world and used them. And these are some awesome picks. I just want one more. I got an awesome sword. <laughs> By the way, if you didn't know, White Fire is an na awesome name for a sword and a um, person you should follow. It's the name of a YouTuber that isn't a popular YouTuber, but should be. And somebody I'm probably going to be collaborating with at some time soon, if I ever get my life in order. It's busy, busy. I have a family, and they need me more than you. See, I, I only said that so I can play it to, you know, my wife, so she knows. Really. What were you doing there? Hmm. It's nice to know that, uh, Two kills hits a, or two strikes hits a, kill is a creeper. Come on, jump, jump. <laughs> so let's drop off this amazing material. What am I doing? Oh man, here it is. You see how easy it was to drive by? Drive by, yeah. It's a drive-by. This is what, I, what I've done in the past. Let me drop some of this stuff off. Smelt, smelt. 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 Let me uh, take these out and put them in the proper chest so I know where to find them. No, I don't want you there. Hey, look, I got some dirt. Now I can fill up all those creeper holes I've made. So where we got 18, that's it? That's not even enough to make the... for an entrance. Sad. I'm going to have to double chest you. Um, that's good. Let's go. Oh. Let's not. Let's do one thing real quick. Thank you. This is what I do um, to make sure I don't walk past the center place. I mean, usually this is a two or three block wide thing, but I didn't do that here just because saving time and this is a series you guys are watching and saving time is a good thing. So let's get back out there. See now when you turn around, you see the um, redstone torch and you know that's where home is. Because you can walk right by that and go to the other side and not even realize it. And seeing that these tunnels are 500 blocks long, that's a big pain in the butt. And anything to make the game easier is good. 
That's right, I said good. One, oops, no. One, two, three, four, five. I think that one went into there by accident. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, four. I said five. So yes, while I'm uh, digging out this main chamber, when I finally get to it, um, I'm going to have a spawning platform that's probably five or six levels high. And even when it's done, and right in the center of the main cave, um, the monsters are going to be falling out of the ceiling and landing on the hopper area and going, well... Well, I don't have any blocks on my bar. How lovely. I don't want to block it with that. Let's block it with this. Excuse me. Dang it. Hmm. Let me put this over here for a second. I hope I did it. I don't think I did. Let's go figure out what's going on over here. Hmm. You could either, I could either obsidian. get obsidian, make this into obsidian, and uh, cut it out, but I think I'm just gonna do a path through the center of this and hopefully not have any problems. <laughs> Famous last words, right? The f I hope in the future they don't consistently make um, lava pools at weird levels like this. But you never know. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of that. Maybe this is what I'll do. I'll obsidi obsidianize the top of it. See how I did that? I actually purposely put that there to not wipe out my torches. Yes, I plan ahead. I took so much planning, it was unbelievable. Okay, I'm making shit up now. When I uh, did that first bucket, I'm like, oh man, I'm going to get rid of all my torches. But nope. One, two, three, four, five. Three, four, five. Yeah. Oh yeah. Good stuff. Whoa. Where are we at? One, two, three, four, five. This video is going to be Lots of me counting to five. I've got to prove to you that I can actually do it. So this is video is being recorded way before it's going to be released. So if any world events happens between now and then, I won't be mentioning it in this video. Like updates to the game. One, two, three. I'm hearing hints of 1.9. And unless there is major terrain generation type stuff, 
the 1.9 I'm gonna keep you know just move this world up into uh, 1.9 to play and as a matter of fact I should tell you this now uh, 1.8.4 came out and that's what I'm playing now which is the latest one at this particular moment but uh, nothing real new has happened in this other than uh, security issue which was rudely and uh, brought to Mojang's Mojang's attention I hear the spiders above me I really hope there's like a a mine you know what I mean maybe this will bring me to it would be nice to have a spider spawner is what I'm saying looks like this is gonna be a big area so I'm gonna move these torches over there bring these out for a couple minutes I hear you oh I hear you too let's get rid of any possible things that are gonna kill me more lava up here yeah oh hey buddy sounds like we're in a big world don't forget that diamond Ooh. creeper yep sounds like we've hit a massive cave structural area which I was thinking we weren't going to be doing because we're almost done with the mine length we do not want to be shot down there but we do want to check it out let's go hi creeper man thought you were going to blow up on me but no You're not good enough for that. Urr. I hear tons of skeletons. Maybe I can find another spawner down here. A nice skelly spawner would be nice because until I get my infinity bow, um, I guess I should grab this stuff because this is the end of the, the way. Ooh, that's the only one. Yeah, it's gonna, yeah. Run away! So yes, um, I got a message today that I should beautify my my um, my main spawn area, and I do plan on doing that because I think I'm gonna play this world for a long time. Oh, no, not that. To the point where I think people will lose interest in the series and come back later and be, like, amazed where it is. It's just hard to f follow a series like this continually for a long time. Because it's... Oh, shoot. R.I.P. Redstone. Because it's not the most interesting series, but um, it's kind of like a baseball season. You know, you don't need to watch every single pitch or every single inning in a year to get good satisfaction out of a good year of baseball. Thankfully. Let's put one of these in there there let's 
get away, let that despawn for a couple seconds. I'm so happy lava is quicker than it used to be. Let's go up. Hello, sir. Just wait for me so I can kick your ass. Thank you. Do you have more sirs over here? Yes, you do. I hear you coming. And there's that stupid spider. Ooh, I thought I was going to get a creeper face blast. I was kind of rather lucky there. Okay, another dead end. I like dead ends. Not because I'm not looking for stuff and enjoy killing these things, but means I can turn around and start collecting this stuff and work my way into another part of the cave. So day ends are good. Even though I hear stuff and water over there, I'm going to let it go because I imagine one of these side channels will eventually, eventually lead me to... to where I need to be. I feel like this is probably going to turn around and go to that place that I was just at. Hmm. Another problem with Silk Touch. Oh, I'm about to lose my feet. Is that I don't have coal readily already broken up for use. I hear ya. But I don't see you. Confusing cave. There's a lot of stuff here though. But not a shit ton of iron. I mean, diamonds. Which is fine. I will be finding diamonds sooner or later. And I know I've passed some up exploring this. So yeah, I've been trying to record this episode for a few days now. Um, remember how I was really, really sick? Well, my fiance got the same way. And uh, she probably had it worse than I did. And it's made things a little difficult. Um, again, multiple ER visits. Got it. Oh, I got a yay, a bow. I have to um, get some regular coal. Because another problem with silk touching is
you know. I should stop doing that. I like start a sentence and never finish it. Um, part of the problem with silk touching is, is you don't actually get the coal to use at that time. You just get the blocks. So I'm um, once I get this cave area filled out when I start collecting blocks again, I'll I'll hit some with a normal pick to get some coal. Pretty obvious. 